Almost 630 here on a Monday morning, a drier Monday morning after an extremely wet day around our state yesterday. We had more than two inches of rain in so many parts of Iowa, including right here in the Des Moines Metro. Some spots recorded over three inches of rain. You'll be happy to know it's drying out today. We needed that moisture and we have more on the way, but not today. The clouds will start to break apart later on and we will see some sunshine before the day is totally done. But with yesterday's rainfall, we are now two and a half inches above average for rainfall in the month of October. We have not been able to say above average on rainfall in months because we've been in such a severe drought around our state for the whole fall so far. Remember, we count that since September 1st. We are just a smidge above average and for the entire year we are still about seven and a half inches below average, so we can still handle more rainfall. Our rivers, our streams, everything is doing fine. There's no flooding concerns. It will stay dry today and tomorrow, but by Wednesday and Thursday more rain is going to be building in and it's a pretty high chance of rain both days around our state. It's our next storm system that will bring a stationary boundary and bring us exactly a chance of rain. I think on Wednesday morning, late Tuesday night after midnight into Wednesday morning over western Iowa. Then it moves into central Iowa come Wednesday afternoon and evening and it lingers into Thursday too. By Friday, I expect that will clear out and we will see a drier weekend, but this one could bring us some steadier rainfall over a longer period of time. Again, we could see two, maybe two and a half inches of rain over parts of western Iowa and central Iowa, probably a little less than what we had yesterday, but nonetheless very wet for the middle of the week. Today we will start off cloudy. We will see sunshine coming out during the afternoon by two o'clock. 50 degrees by 4 p.m. about 51. Our high today is 52. Most everybody can expect low to mid 50s for highs and then we will go to the upper 50s tomorrow with a partly cloudy sky on Wednesday. Once that rain moves in, we do start to cool off again. Here's our whole plumbing and heating 10 day forecast. Thursday will be the chilliest day with windy weather and that rain a high of just 49. We have a great Halloween weekend coming our way. Trick or treaters will stay dry Saturday and Sunday night and then the first couple days of of November will be on the chilly side. Brandon, thank you very much. Let's take a short break, everyone. And the pandemic.